guys, welcome to another video. <laughs> I have my friend here, Miriam. She was with hey. me in a Kabla. Yeah, Kabla. Kabla. All right, a few videos ago. <laughs> and uh, where are we today? Uh, Jibba. We're in Jibba. And then we'll be, we'll be hiking up a little mountain. It's not too hard. And then after we'll go to uh, Duga. Is that correct? Yeah. Duga? Yes. Yes, an old Roman village. So, yeah. pretty good. Continue our trek up to the mountains right behind us there, and uh, we have a nice lookout. Let's go and take a look at the view. Take a look in the back there. There is a small waterfall. Now it's drying up now because it's getting to summer, but sometimes it's a little more water coming over. Of course, I'm going to show you closer. below where the water is falling you'll see a structure there, there. Uh, I don't know how they got that built on that ledge I don't know what it was used for <laughs> interesting and look behind me you would see the overhangs where it forms like these shallow caves that provide shelter in the sunlight and it's just a nice place to relax all natural is nature fantastic walking around the mountain and we're going to go up to the top of it. So we're hiking up, we're passing through these large crevices and rocks. So nice. And here we are on the top on the edge of the mountain. Look at that view. Is it good, Miriam? Yes, very good. Very nice. nice. You have to be careful though. I don't want to, you know. <laughs> All right, so we came up to the top, we saw Relaxed a little bit, took a view, and now we're heading back down. Alright, we're back by the bus. We're gonna get on and then we're gonna head to Doga. Let's go. So here we are in Doga, an old Roman city that's in ruins, but it is still almost intact in Africa. This is one of the best examples of a preserved Roman uh, city. Right now we're in the theater, the amphitheater. So fantastic. little away from the main amphitheater there where we enter we walk a bit and we come across the temple of Saturn now it's in ruin so most of the pillars and whatnot are down but still magnificent thousands of years it's still here it's kind of midway between Algeria at that point and uh, Cathar, which was the principal city, so it was used as kind of a granary storage and trade route on the way to Cathar from Algeria. A lot of history as you can see. We're walking through these roads and they're all Roman roads that we're still using. Isn't that amazing? in front of the capital building. So of course, one of the major features of Duga is the capital building. And right around it, there are major 
places like the market, uh, there is the Mercury Temple behind it, the Byzantine, that big wall there. Where is it? Yeah, that big wall is a Byzantine fortifications and right now we're in the Forum. So it was like the central of town here. And it is still, still here and we could still come and experience it. I wonder if the structures we build will be around over 2,000 years from now. behind us you'll see a very good example of a Roman house really nice so this entire area as you can see is filled it's the village and its houses and different temples and whatnot still here so you know we could get a, a nice pity of how life was back then so we're in the area with the public baths and we're heading further in have a room here right off the bus where they come to relax and there's still original mosaic on the ground. Amazing. We are still in the bath area and we're going to go into the service entrance. How the, the servants are what that came. So it's kind of like a little tunnel. So let's head in. No Roman village would be complete without public toilets. And we're back. We're at the amphitheater again. So we walked around, we got a nice in-depth tour. And of course, I don't want to share every little detail the tour guide gave. I want to encourage people, if you're in Tunisia, you visit Doga and experience the tour for yourself. So I'll just show you highlights in this video. As always, I really enjoyed sharing this experience with you. Remember to like, subscribe, all those good things. And until next time, I'll see you guys. Okay.